Hi BCs, it's Kim, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I have got this makeup look for you guys. I use a lot of old products in this video, like a lot of like old Fenty like makeup. Like right now, quarantine's got me, you know, going through my makeup drawers and like getting stuff that I haven't used in quite a while and like reusing it and seeing if it's still, you know, going away later, you know what I'm trying to say? I don't know what's going on in my hair today, but it's not acting right, so. Yeah. If you guys like this video, if you do, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below if you are new to my channel, join the family. We welcome everyone here. And then turn my mouth. That is pretty much all I have to say. So let's just straight into this video. Hey guys, so I'm gonna start off using my P. Louise base. Um, I started off using my ring finger to do this and then I switched to a brush just because your girl couldn't like get into the corners and it was just too hard for your girl, like honestly. I just ended up using a brush to apply this base evenly and then I'm gonna go into my Urban Decay Born to Run palette. Um, I don't have this palette with me right now so I can't really tell you guys the name but I'm using this dark pink shade and I'm placing that in my crease I'm really like stamping it on and not blending it out then I'm gonna go in with the orange shade to blend it out and I'm using this as my transition color and I'm going back and forth with the two shades adding more if I need to as you can see that I keep losing some colors um, with the shadows so I just kept going back and forth till I liked what it looked like. So moving on, I'm just going to go and uncut my crease. I am using the P. Louise base again as like my concealer to like cut my crease. And then I'm just going to go back in with that dark pink shade and just placing it on my outer corners. And now I'm grabbing this light peach eyeshadow and I'm just placing that all over my lid. This look is quite simple, but you guys know that I love doing um, wearable looks, but like giving you guys different colors as well so now i'm just going in with my eyeliner my liquid eyeliner from nyx cosmetics and then going in with my fast strip mascara from collection now i'm just showing guys that i use my white and red paint to create this pink shade i'm just using that to define my cut crease moving on to skin i'm using my fenty beauty pro filter primer i haven't used this in so long my brother came to say hi and he's so cute so now moving back to the makeup, I'm going to be using my Urban Decay All Night Setting Spray, spraying that all over my face, and then getting my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation in the shade 450. The brush I'm using is my Vanity Planet brush. You guys can get 70% off. It's all down below if you want it. To conceal and contour my face, I am using the Fenty Beauty Match Sticks Trio, the highlighter shade I did use at the end of the video. So I'm just warming the concealers up at the back of my hands because that's what our auntie Riri showed us to do. So that's what I did. I love the tones and the shade of this matchsticks, but I don't like how like it tugs onto your skin. Do you know what I mean? But what I do love is the Fenty Beauty Concealer. I freaking love this bad boy. If you guys know me, I used to bank out this concealer like day in, day out. But you know. So now I'm just going over my Real Technique sponge and I'm just blending out my concealer then i'm just gonna go with a brush and then blending out my contour as well and then you guys already know the drill i'm gonna go in with my foundation brush and then blend everything together and now i'm just lightly going in and setting my highlighted areas with my mua face powder in the shade 170. all the products that i use will be listed down below as well so don't worry if you don't catch on to what i'm saying so now i'm just setting my face and i'm using my Too face setting powder to set it i don't know why i didn't show you guys but um that is what i am using and now i'm just gonna go and lightly set the rest of my face and i'm using my mac studio fix powder i'm grabbing that same dark pink shade i'm just running that through my lower lash line i'm also gonna grab the orange as well so as you can see now i'm just dusting off my excess powder and i'm lightly setting my contour area using my makeup revolution and Patricia bright palette face palette applying some lashes and then I'm going to bronze my skin using the Fenty Beauty Mocha Mami Bronzer. Oh, something I was excited about. I reverse contour today, guys. Like, oh my gosh. I don't know who I think I am, but I reverse contour today. And I kind of wish I didn't. But this honestly was like a big risk for me because I don't normally do this. So whilst I'm just letting that set for a minute, I'm going to go in with my lips. And I'm using the Fenty Beauty lipstick in 
p.m. something. I'll put the shade name down below. I'm using this to line my lips. Now I'm just dusting up the excess powder and guys, you can just see my face like, I was thinking like, what the hell is this? I don't like any harsh lines and this, I will not be doing this again. It was so hard to like blend out that harsh line, but hey. <laughs> So now I'm just setting my face using my Urban Decay Oh, it's a setting spray and I'm going in with my Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss. And then just to finish off this look, I am going in with my Fast Shop Mascara and just adding some mascara to my bottom lashes. And then to highlight, I am using the last um, trio in the matchsticks to highlight my face. And that completes today's look. Super easy, right? So this is the end of the video guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, my hair is literally getting on my nerves, just not sitting how it normally sits, I don't know. Anywho, um, I hope you guys liked this video, if you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up, I know quarantine is like getting on everyone's nerves, but girl, stay busy, stay active, you know, practice with makeup, start a TikTok if you haven't already, it's fun. <laughs> what else are the kids doing these days? Um, start a YouTube channel, why not? This is the best time, sis. So like, this is the best time. Keep saying, pretty much. Just keep saying. That's what I want to say. Keep saying, pray. Do the things that you always say that you never have time to do because right now you have the time in the world to do it. So, girl, do it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys liked this video. Like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.